Welcome back everybody, Twitch367 here, and today we're going to continue with episode 73 of our Dungeons Dragons Space Shuttle Season 2 series here on the channel. Once again, if you guys want to interact with me or any of the other members of the Discord, take a peek at the Discord link in the description. While you're down in the description, take a peek at all the other social media links, including the 10% off W link. Helps me out, helps out the company, and it's a great thing to do. Uh, that being said, if you guys also want to join a Dungeons Dragons Space Shuttle server or even a Vault Hunters server, I'll go ahead and check out the Discord. All you have to do is put your name in the whitelist channel and then we can get you added as soon as possible. But with that, we are going to kind of hop right back into this um, because a couple episodes ago, we were working on trying to craft a harvester. Uh, the only thing we were missing was plastic, I believe. So if we back up here, here's all of our components. Um, and yeah, we needed this range add-on, which needed plastic. But luckily for us, we had... We just need to make this. Which looks intimidating, but we could, we could do it. We could definitely do it. Real quick, I want to just get a bunch of sand cooking up. Go. And let's also go take a peek at look at the uh, steel because I haven't been really paying attention to it I know I'm gonna need steel plates this is full need to grab another tank Do we have any stone? Limestone. I think limestone will work. Good. We can at least get three if it will work. So this one is going to be used for more creosote. And a little bit more. So let's start making everything else that we need for the latex processing unit. Um, also, our fluid extractor. Where did we put our servo? My servo might be down here.
let's go back up I do need to find out what uh, produces the most Let's just look up latex Free fluid extractor I needed to look at. Rubber. Okay, so rubber wood. I actually think I'm going to put it in here. Somehow And let's start producing at least a little bit. My remaining two. Actually, I think I have. Looks like we'll be able to finish the uh I stepped in the pressure plate. Forgot there's a spot there we can go through. There we go, we are gaining latex. I'll pull into the latex processing unit when we make it. Okay, I at least got latex going. Not a quest yet, we just make it. Processor bindings, do we have any of those yet? Look like it, but they're really simple to make. Do we? We don't even have any mechanism machines yet.
definitely doable. I think I may be getting ahead of myself, to be honest. Let's uh let's start making the metallurgic infuser real quick after I harvest up our canola real quick. Still need to finish this farm. Uh and Don did remind me of an important thing on one of my videos. Uh the farm's gonna be expanded because of the um the harvester's range. So everything is actually going to be a bit bigger. I like it. Okay, so, um, this, this, sixteen osmium plates. Gonna make sixteen more, keep the five that we already have. Need to hook that up to solar so that we don't have to rely on a uh a coal generator. Alright, so we do need two basic control circuits. happen to have two and a tier one exchanger core I believe single battery is actually one of our quests Is so let's go ahead and make one of these. We are gonna need two buckets of silicone going into his workshop. Need and a nori tin silicone that tin or a tin plate tin plate and was that just normal silicone or was that a uh, silicone plate normal Go. Well, 
blast is the coil. Looks like we don't have the advanced coil. Missing a And let's just craft a couple of these. Boom, boom. What tools are needed for this? Uh, driver, pliers, hammer. Driver. Players. And there's a single battery. Claim that as well. Motor. as well uh, I do need two pieces of stone I'm not sure if it'll auto take from this so I'm just that There's our motor, cleaning tube, filter module, we need to make a tier one storage module still, we need a furnace. I'm literally just missing an iron gear. Kind of crazy that I had everything else in there for that. I will say the scanner is so nice. I'm so glad we're actually using it this season. Grab stone. Go. Six more stone tanks. I will take them. Okay, I only need two more. Oh, that looks so cool. Uh, 
now we have a good amount of storage to the point where we should be able to empty out completely have plenty of room to spare I love the green. So nice. Got a few extra tanks now. Let's go grab our uh, osmium plates. Come up here and craft a metallurgic infuser. Now I'm just going to hook it up here. Right, so this is going to take a couple of enriched alloy. Got that part done. Enriched alloy is steel and redstone. Five pieces of redstone. Should grab another tank. Do that after I get the uh, enriched alloy going. Right, we have 27 steel in there. Four steel in there. We're also going to want to grab a rubber wood. Boom. Eventually, like that whole pillar is going to be just a creosote tank. Rubber wood is taken care of. Rearrange some things that. Go. That's a couple of enriched alloy. Those. Uh, advanced control circuit. I need to make another advanced control circuit. Also need to make some regular control circuits. We got in here. Ingots.
that one will cast into there. Alright, so maybe I'll make the circuits between episodes or even next episode. Uh, for now, let's make a steel gear. Take care of that. So this is how we have to do it with methane gas. Uh, we just need two pieces of steel. Looks like actually just one because I already have a steel rod. Here with crab. And then we just need the specific tools. Burner, hammer, pliers. Alright, that also took some plates for the outside. What were they? Bronze and steel. So I need 8 bronze and 8 steel. I'm just going to toss those plates back just so that we have them. Here, get the bronze, get that going. And then bronze are just corners. Okay. So next episode, I think, because I'll be recording that like right after this one, um, we're going to go ahead and just bust out. Don't know what one I want to do yet, but I might even bust out advanced alloy. Maybe a couple platinum and just go for five all at once. Might be worth it. Advanced alloy is just steel, bronze, and tin. I believe that's also a quest that we have to do. Some. They gave us another block of bronze, which was worth it. Let's just toss those in there. Same with those processor bindings. Ancient dust as well. Alright, and that's just by cooking that up. So... Uh, 
Oh, and look at the time. That is actually all the time we have for this episode. So if you guys did enjoy, be sure to leave a like, comment, subscribe if you have not already. Next episode, we are going to just continue along. Um, like I said, we're going to make the batch of five if possible uh, so that we can make the latex processing unit so then we can make the range add-on and then we can make the harvester and then we can start working on getting everything moved into more permanent spots because even my uh, canola setup is going to be moved I think it might stay I'm not sure just yet I might have two canola setups uh, like maybe this one is going to be used for like my machines uh, and then maybe the other one will be kind of just another power setup canola if we're producing enough that is uh, but with that hope you guys have a great day i will see you in the next one see ya